in the heart of a quaint village named Harmonica. There lived two families, the Evergreens and the Mellow Brooks, who were known throughout the village for their remarkable talents. The Evergreens were skilled painters, their artistry capturing the beauty of nature in vivid colors, while the Mellow Brooks were renowned musicians, their melodies carrying emotions that touched souls. For generations, the two families had shared a friendly rivalry, always seeking to outdo each other's talents. It began as innocent competition, with friendly banter exchanged during village gatherings. However, over the years, this rivalry transformed into a bitter feud. Small slights and misunderstandings led to resentment and hurt feelings, turning the village into a tense battlefield of artistic egos. The villagers watched in sadness as the beautiful tapestry of friendship and camaraderie unraveled. Between the two once close families, the vibrancy of harmonica began to fade as the bitterness between the evergreens and pay. Mellow Brooks deepened. One fateful day, the village received an invitation from a neighboring town to participate in a grand festival. Celebrating art and music. This festival was known to attract the most skilled artists and musicians from far and wide. And it was an opportunity for the village of Harmonica to showcase their talents to the world. Excitement filled the air, but a cloud of doubt hung over the villagers. Would the Evergreens and the Mellow Brooks be able to put aside their differences and work together? For the sake of the village, the village council convened to discuss the invitation. And it was decided that the Evergreens and the Mellow Brooks would have to collaborate to create a masterpiece that combined both their talents. The news was met with shock and resistance from both families. Old wounds were torn open. Grievances were recounted. And blame was tossed around like fiery darts. Seeing the turmoil, an elder named Arya stepped forward. Arya had once been the closest of friends with the founders of both families and carried the wisdom of ages. She had seen the village transform from a harmonious haven into a land divided by pride and resentment. With a calm voice, Arya recounted a tale from the village's history, a story of unity and compassion. She spoke of a time when a drought had plagued the land. And it was the joint efforts of the Evergreens and the Mellow Brooks that had saved the village. Their talents had combined to create a beautiful rain dance that brought water back to their fields. And smiles back to their faces. Her words hung in the air. Heavy with the weight of forgotten memories and lost bonds. The two families exchanged uneasy glances. Realizing the truth in Arya's words. The village that they cherished was on the verge of losing its vibrancy forever. All because of their stubborn pride. The silence was broken by a single, soft note played on a harmonica by a young child from the village. The note lingered in the air. Its melancholic tone a reflection of the village's current state. Then, from the other side of the square, the sound of a gentle brush stroke against canvas resonated. A young evergreen had begun to paint, his strokes capturing the essence of the melody. As if guided by an unseen force, the two families slowly converged. The mellow brooks began to play a melody that mirrored the brush strokes of the evergreen painter. The village watched in awe as the music and the painting intertwined, creating a symphony of forgiveness and reconciliation. Tears flowed freely from eyes that had witnessed years of animosity, as the bitterness of the past was transformed into a shared masterpiece of harmony. The two families, once torn apart by pride, found themselves united by the very talents that had driven them apart. The village of Harmonica had witnessed a miracle. The miracle of forgiveness and the power of letting bygones be bygones. When the festival arrived, the Evergreens and the Mellow Brooks presented their collaborative masterpiece to a captivated audience. The village of Harmonica had not only brought their talents to the world, but they had also brought a message of healing and unity. 
The melody and painting spoke of a journey from rivalry to reconciliation. Inspiring everyone who witnessed it to embrace forgiveness and let go of past grievances. And so, from that day forward, the village of Harmonica became a living testament to the moral of the story. The beauty that arises when we let bygones be bygones and allow the symphony of forgiveness to mend. The broken chords of our lives.